okay welcome back to my channel you're gonna see me demo this beautiful bob wig from love me hair that i was sent to review this is a beautiful 1b 14 inch 200 percent 200 percent you heard me closure wig this is a closure i know it's giving front some vibes i know <laughs> you know hello baby hairs or whatever but yes, get into it. You know, let me bag up, let me bag up. So it came in this lovely purple box. I think these are some newer boxes because it's, it's, you know, it's the boxes never look like this. It's like more of a dark. It was a purple box, but it's even a little shimmer vibe. So yes, you know. So let me show you the goodies. The infamous duster bag. I love this bag. When I take off my wigs, it goes. Once I wash them, it goes back in this bag. This is what keeps it like separated and keep the hair still good. So they're, they have new packaging that comes, you know, in the bag. Let me show you. I don't know if anyone showed you. Um, they have these little look, this cute little bags. And let's, let me show you the goodies that comes with it. Um, Cause I remember the other bags they used to come with, but you know, it's a new year, you, new, you do new things. They come with two sets of lashes and these are some nice lashes. I wish I would have went through this bag before. I could have put some lashes on. Come a little scrunchie. I like this. This is really nice. Scrunchies are coming back in. And this is a nice color. So it comes with some, some hoops, you know. I don't have any gold hoops, so I might I might use these. Let's see. What else? What else? Oh, I guess you put this on the back of your phone. Like a little kickstand. This is really cute. Um, but yes, these are the goodies that comes in the bag. Um, so they're changing up their packaging. It's a new year. So you got to change it up, switch it up. Can't keep it the same. So you're going to see me install this beautiful wig. You know, I am a beginner of wig installs, but you know, I call myself the finesse queen. So thank you, um, Tori Dolls for, you know, sticking with me. I should be having more videos coming. Um, I'm just getting back to me, getting back to doing reviews. And stay tuned uh, for the installation. So you can watch me slay this wig. Come on, let me show you. Oh, you see my chest? Let me show you. <laughs> but yes, this hair is gorgeous. So, okay. The next clip will be me installing this wig. So stay tuned. Y'all excuse me. Why I'm on here with my jailhouse braids? Somebody come get my. Somebody come get that sand. Good. Go. Let me put. Let me put this wig cap on. <laughs> Child, I am embarrassed. You hear me? How y'all liking the setup? You know, it's not bad. It's pretty. It's pretty big. You know. Okay. Okay. Let me stop. <laughs> Let me stop. I'm not doing the ball cap me method. Ball cap method because it's a closure wig. Closure wig. Um, so you know, I already don't want to hit a style it, but it need a little little help, you know. Done like putting on your head and styling it. So let me put it on and see what we're working with, okay? <laughs> I am back, okay. Bob the bob, you know. She's getting what she's supposed to give, honey. It's nice and secure. So I plucked. I gave a little pluckity pluck, but I didn't want to do too much because it's just a closure. You know, you don't want to pluck too much and be, <laughs> you don't got no hair to work with. So, baby. And then I used my concealer that matches my skin tone to, you know, blend it in. So I think this is where I wanted to go. I already kind of pre styled her on the mannequin head. It makes your installs quick and. So what I'm gonna use to adhere yes, now. Yes, even y'all need to sponsor me. Black Come on, honey, Black, Black Can, Can edition. edition. Yes, sir. This is where I want her to go. I have a, even though it's a closure wig, look how far the parting is, honey. Honey. And I did a little pluck, you know, a little pluck in action. But I don't want to do too much and, like, lose lose the hair. So, it's very snug. I'm going to go back over with, like, a hot comb and a concealer. But, girl, this is a 14-inch bob wig by Love Me Hair. It's 200% 200, 200 density. Look. I had to slow the audio down. Body? Body? All right. 
I already look, look a little wop sided back there, but I just want you to see. So let's go, let's get into and here in this down. Okay. Okay, here's a time lapse of me installing um, my closure wig. Get into it, get into it real quick and simple. We are back here down. Okay. So I like to go in just to make sure, cause make sure none of my skin is like in there. So just to get that fine melt. Ooh, a little, ooh, a little nappy nap. I'm gonna take my elastic band to get get that perfect melt. So let me just. Okay, y'all, if y'all still watching, thumbs up if you if you like um this location. The lighting is giving is giving. It's giving what it's supposed to give. Come on, thumbs up. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. All right, get back into the video. Just behind my ear. You know, like for the closure, you really don't have to do all of this, but I want I want my closure to look like a dang on frontal. So I'm gonna do all of this, but you don't have to. You can really just cut off the lace and just keep it moving. But I'm not about to do that. You know? I'm going to go the extra mile, the extra step. So it can look like a, a dang on frontal. I'm just trying to put all the hair back. Behind the elastic band. There we go. And I'm about to go in and, you know, flat iron it one last time to get it bumped. Right, I'm gonna bring it, bring my camera down. And this is a 14 inch. You can, if you want like a short bob, you can definitely go shorter. Um, but I, I like this length. You know, you can play with it, and you know, like if you're not feeling the bob, you can throw some curls in it. You know, but this is a long bob. Like, it's perfect. It's perfect for the winter going into the. Is it the the fall? Hell, if I know. But yes. And look, you know, you see how dark this is? Like, it's really like a, like a dark 1B, you know? I didn't have to color it. The only thing that I did to this wig was bleach the knots. And you don't have to do that because it's a closure. And I did a, few, a little plucking. That's it. It was already pre-plucked. It's just that simple. Just that simple. I'm going to go over with my blow, my blow dryer. Okay. Let me put my flat irons on and I'll be back. Be back. All right, so let me. I got my flat iron. Remington. Remington. Baby, who would have thought this $20 flat iron off Amazon will be bummed back home? It's not part of it. It's a little crooked, but it's on. At this point, it's on. Be what it's on. Boy! Yes, sir. <laughs> Come on, then. So I'm about to flat iron this to make it, you know, make it seamless. Yeah, see how good this flat iron is. Ten dollars. Oh shh. Sh Uses. Oh, that was a little hot. Every time. Give me bob to bob. So, I think it's time to cut off the lace and see, see how I did. See what we're working with. <sighs> this is the hard part. <laughs> Let me take this headband off. Okay, so the best thing to use when cutting off lace is a little, little razor. And I got these little bitty scissors. Little cuticle scissors. This is the best thing to use to cut off a lace, honey. So I'm trying to, I'm going to try to, oh Lord, it's hot in here. So I'm like, I don't want to mess up. Because if you mess up, it's over with. It's over. Some baby hairs, but. Sorry guys, I could be better in focus, but I was just so nervous. You don't want to mess up the lace, lace. Okay, so I got my little razor. Here we go. 
not too bad not too bad we can fix that just that little piece we're gonna do some baby hairs to cover that up but you want it to be flat and your scalp okay come on And, you know, I don't, and then I just go back. I and also, guys, I am like not a pro. I okay. call myself the wig finesse. Because, baby, I will finesse a wig. Oh God, you make it look like, you know, look, make it look like what it can look. Okay. You hear me? The finesse. -er. That's what I'm calling myself. Okay. Back to the video. So it's crazy because you can you really can cut yourself. Nobody don't be talking about it, but you really can do some, you know, some little damage. Oh child, Lord, don't look at my underarms. I'm embarrassed. Okay, back to the video. Oh, you gotta see a little bit. But you know what? What you do is, I'm gonna take, take your melt band in a little bit. And I'm about to go out there. I'm about to pull out me some baby hairs. But you... foreclosure back to the video taking out milk bed on okay i like a little baby hairs, like a little bit i'm still learning how to do baby hairs but you know so i have to bring a little bit of the hair over to hide that little band area but it's okay this, this wig is coming out really good let me take it out i'm gonna mess it so i ain't smack i'm supposed to be going on a date don't you hate people that's like last minute dates and he said he want to go meet somewhere at 30. Like, it's 7 30. Like, pick a place. Pick a place. I can be there. If you don't pick a place by 8 o'clock, I'll be, I don't even know what I'm wearing. So I'm just trying to get my hair 
taking care of so I can find something to wear. Makeup already did. I forgot to put a lip on. But dating in 2022 is is tricky in itself. I'm newly single, so you know I'm just trying to put myself out there, but it, it's hard sometimes. It's definitely hard. But sometimes I just want to be in a house. But that's a video for something. That's a, another video. Let me know if y'all want to have a girl's talk about dating, dating in 2022. This is a video. Y'all, I'm me. serious. If y'all want a video of me talking about dating in 2022, being 30 plus. Wait a minute. In my early 30s. Come simmer down. Simmer down. You know, dating. Like, I'm newly single. You know, I'm just trying to get back into this dating world. But anyway, that's another story. We can get into that. Comment below if you want to see a video of that. Get back into the video. But I will. But, you know, fly ways. Gone. All right, we're back at these baby yeah, I needed a shave, and then I'm resting. Look at my elbow. Oh, I, got the phone I, I am embarrassed, but baby, I'm just keeping it real. You know, keeping it real. Let me get back to this video. Let me start roasting myself. If they blow it, get it. Girl. Okay, so let me show you how I did. Let me show you what I did. It's giving, it's giving Scalpiano. Like, this baby here really, it really don't matter, but. And this is the, ooh. This is the same little tool I use to cut off the lace. So I just you just put some foam somewhere on my forehead, on my hair. It's okay. Take a little, and I got this from Love Me. This come in the packet. You know, this is the best edge brush on the market. And I just go. And I know they're too long, so I just go and just cut. Cut. There we go. Baby, look look at the luster on that hair. I did not color this hair at all. It came this nice one B color. You know, I'm just saying. Love me, y'all outdid yourself. This wig y'all sent me. Come on in, like, did I melt it? Finesse, I told you, I'm the finesse queen, baby. Get into it. Get into it. Myself every freaking time. I haven't had a bob in so long. So, you know, if I want to do this, you know, I like doing lift the top or shorter with the hair. Oops, sorry. But, don't So, hold on, hold on. I'm just going to get some of my baby hairs. I'll be putting on my baby hairs too. Hey, Eco? Eco? It, it gets in a little hole, but it's a manageable hole. I'm giving y'all all the tips I learned on YouTube. I went to the, the University of YouTube. I did. Like, I put that on my baby hairs and it lays it down for at least 24 hours, you know, until it's time to, for the weed to come off. But they even in the black can, baby. It, it holds the wig down for at least two to three days if you ain't going to the gym. I'm just saying. Okay, back to the video. Here's a picture of me rocking the wig the next day with a different beat and a red lip. Like, comment, and subscribe. Thanks for tuning in.